what are the things between, you know, for the 24 hours preparing uh, that an actor can do that will help them have that better session or even on their way to the session or even uh, during the session while you're shooting? Uh, the things that the actor can control, the things that the actor can do to prepare to have a great headshot session. I would say drink a lot of water. Yeah. <laughs> I would say... Uh, as far as wardrobe preparation, which that might go into another subject, but it's it's it is part of this. Sure. It's just being being prepared. Know your looks. Know what looks good on you. Um, I I usually send an email out to clients that discusses wardrobe selection and choices and what's going to work and what's not going to work and what colors to wear and things along those lines. And it will be, it's very helpful, you know, before your session to know. Hey, let me try on this. This I I, I have clients that will go out and buy stuff an hour before their session with the tags on it and they, mm -hmm. and they have it, which is, dude, that, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. But the only issue with that is you're better off being prepared. And the night before you tried on a bunch of things, you know, it's going to work, you know, what brings out you a certain way and you feel comfortable in it. Right. Um, the comfort factor with clothing, some people it's, it's amazing. I've had people show up and they pull out the wardrobe and they go, well, I bought this. I really don't like it, but I bought it cause it's this color. Well, I got this. I don't really like the way that fits, but I'm like, well, why did you bring it then? <laughs> like, don't don't bring if you don't like it and you don't feel excited about it. Right. You you know because it's like when you you know when you go out for the night. If I put on a certain suit, I put on a certain pair of shoes, and I'm dressed, and I know I just feel ridiculous. It's like right. okay, I feel really good right now. There's no stopping me. Mm -hmm. And then I've I've had those moments where I feel like shit, and I just know I feel like shit. I'm like, oh, I hate this freaking frumpy t-shirt. I'm getting fat, and I just look like a mess. And you know what you feel like. So know what you feel like and wear what feels good and what's going to make you feel comfortable and confident. Right. And that's really a, a big deal. So the night before, lay all that stuff out. Know which things really make you you and what colors work for you really well based w within certain parameters because you might say hot pink is your color, but you're not going to wear that for a headshot. Mm -hmm. So between between the, the preparation with – your wardrobe preparation with, you know, drinking a lot of water, obviously, and just maintaining like grooming stuff. And then as far as I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't tell an actor to pose per se, or, you know, that you should work on things in the mirror. Cause it's, it, it, it's, it'll be a futile exercise. It's kind of like, you know, when you show up, we kind of go through all that. There's, right. no, there's no training. I can say, well, go to the mirror and do this mm -hmm. other than be comfortable with your own skin. That's all I can say. It's more in the head than it is anywhere else. Yeah, so whatever that takes. If you got to do some yoga in the morning or do a little meditation or journaling or something that gets you in your space so that you're centered and uh, confident and ready to go. Um, and, and, and the other thing is, is to um, not overthink it. Because mm. if, you, if you overthink, if you make your headshot like you're going to be taking like some cpa exam <laughs> then who the hell's not going to be nervous i mean right. if you or you know oh you know i gotta go audition for scorsese tomorrow in person at his right. home in front of his family you know that's a, that, that would drive you up a wall the night you how could how do you how would you prepare for that if that opportunity came up you'd be nuts right with your headshot you kind of have to you know it, it sounds like i'm contradicting the, our, our opening conversation that it's the, the most important thing but don't treat it like that the night before. You have to understand you're taking a photo. Don't get it in your head that you've got to be absolutely perfect and everything's got to be a certain way. Let it go and be yourself and be comfortable with, okay, you know, relax. Like you said, yoga, meditation, stretching, do what you got to do. Treat it kind of casual and we'll get this done.